Who is in command here? I need information on the Gormak ship. I'm in command of this outpost. I can tell you of the ship. My second in command led a strike force to the construction site. They could not breach its shields. What stopped them? Too many Gormak? Automated defenses? Kotalde, speak of your battle at the ship construction site. My commandos attempted to reach the shield generators. The Gormak were organized and waiting, led by one they call their king, Joko. They were too many and too entrenched. We were forced to turn back. Since when do Gormak plan defenses? They're brutes. Jokul has united them. This has never happened before. The ship is nearly finished. It will be capable of attacking Voska by air. The generators surround the ship. Many Gormak will defend them. Take these. Once the shield is down, plant the charges on the ship. That will keep it from the stars. Explosion shook the ground. The Gormak surely know their ship will never fly. Now is our chance to strike a Jokul, their leader. I have sent a strike team ahead. They will need your help. Jokul retreated to his stronghold. He has taken some of our wounded with him. Are they hostages? Can Gormak even negotiate? We don't know. This has never happened before. My second, Kotalde, will join your assault inside. Thank you. None of the Gormak we've encountered so far seem to be in charge. Where is their leader? Much further into the stronghold. The bulk of the Gormak horde are in the passages ahead. They will rush to the defense of their king. We should eliminate Jokul's potential reinforcements. Many commandos would die in the cave-in, but so would the Gormak. Cruelty comes easy for you, doesn't it? We will join you again when it is done. Rigno em di handsome jum vi sagore kilomba. You will never reach the stars. The mystics have seen your failure. Ting fu va kun cho kak cho tu ning ba yoi hoi wa. A Gormak dares to speak as if he has a mystic's knowledge. This is sacrilege! It's nothing. An idle threat. Framivos Visions are a sacred gift, given only to mystics. They are not given to beasts like him. Where did you get this power? How do you use it? The Dark Heart is an evil place. All who go near it are driven mad. No one returns from there. Foy Khan Sakri Shepua, Mababong Chang Pirapanyen, Kimaki Ovadia Tochong, Amin Swan Gotrong Babos. I'll kill you when I'm done with you. Until then, you'll do as I say. Oh no, me this come country near Roy so calm. They come ni go bang line, chofe, that chong, that I'm so. Come try, chuava, I dram, nam, my chong, dito. You have power. Stop complaining and use it. I'll give you to the Voss. Your visions might be worth something to them. We will take him to Telson Fall and report Kotal Day's death. You should report to your people in Voss Ka as well. Go with our gratitude.
News of your victory preceded you. The entire city is talking of it. They say you took this so-called Gormak King captive. The fools are entirely convinced you are the agent of their prophecy. Well done indeed. Sama Ro said something about bringing new wisdom. Which could mean anything. It might even refer to Voss joining the Empire. It's nothing. Sama Ro has already asked for an audience with you. The gentleman you wish to speak with has returned, Emissary. The Gormak ship has been destroyed. They shall not reach the stars. You are the one from the Vision. The three have heard the report of your battle with Choco. They are troubled. Gormak are not mystics. They have no visions. This is the new wisdom the prophecy foretold. It lies in the dark heart. I need more information on this place. Who or what is in there? The Dark Heart is an evil place deep within the Nightmare Lands. We are forbidden to go there. We do not know what it holds. You must return to us with this knowledge. I would be more than proud to help. You have our gratitude. Well done. One final move, and Voss will be ours. It won't be simple. Even the most powerful Sith have not made it far into the Dark Heart. I doubt there's reason to worry. The power of the Dark Side is overwhelming there. Strong enough that it drives even Sith mad. Dark Lord Murbeck Gen dwells on the edge of the Dark Heart, studying its power. He alone has managed to withstand the madness. Seek him in the Nightmare Lands. He must know a way for you to defend yourself from the Dark Power. Lem, stop chewing on... Do I need to get out the penalty collar? No, Lem, Apologies, my lord. Lem here wandered too far into the Nightmare Lands, went completely mad. Now he's helping me perfect my new vaccine. A remarkable specimen, but tedious company. As long as he keeps his hands to himself, we won't have a problem. Of course, my lord. Clinical trials of the vaccine have been promising. My serum repels the Nightmare Land's degenerative effects and boosts pain tolerance. All my formula requires is the catalyst. Sap from a very special tree in the Nightmare Lands. Unfortunately, the sap is a delicacy of the local raid population. Something to wash down all those troops they've been snacking on. I take it the raid don't want anyone stealing their dessert. The two expeditions I sent ended, violently judging by the screaming com babble. My vaccine will allow us to one-up the Republic and establish a solid foothold in the Nightmare Lands. Surely you have nothing to fear from the Nightmare Lands, my lord? If you can get that sap, you're welcome to a complimentary dose of my serum. That vaccine of yours could do us some good. I'll take care of it. One more thing. Constant exposure to the corrupted sap has changed the raid. Mutated them into something worse. They're a constant threat to our operations. If you were to thin their numbers, I'm sure you'd be compensated. I have the materials you asked for. I knew you'd fare better than the others. Third time's the charm. And I hear the local raid population has taken a sudden dive. Interesting that. May I? Oh yes, this should complete my vaccine perfectly. We'll start mass producing it immediately. How long before you can start distributing the vaccine? Not long. Probably get a few more cases like Lem in the meantime, but such is science. You hear that, Lem? Our work here is done. <coughs> Too bad there's nothing I can do about your condition. Oh well. I can always use a willing test subject. Sullivan thinks he's so clever pretending to be interested in the secrets of the Dark Heart. He doesn't appreciate the genius of my work, how intricate the Dark Powers are. I do the important work on Voss. Who in the Emperor's name are you? You're not very good with people, are you? You should not be here. The Dark Power in this place will shatter your mind into a thousand pieces. 
It takes hours of meditation every day for me to keep my mind intact. Clearly, you could put those hours to better use. I will harness the power here, and with it I will bring the galaxy to its knees for the Emperor. Then I shall. Who are you? What do you want? You were telling me about the tomb in the Dark Heart. I... wait. I remember now. Yes. You can serve my research. I'll send you into the Dark Heart. Yes. I pulled this shard from the belly of the Dark Heart. Madness calls to it. There are two ways to defend your mind. Carry it with you while you carve a path of destruction through the denizens of the Nightmare Lands. This shard will stop the dark power from consuming my mind? No, of course not. The hatred and agony of your victims will charge the shard. Then you must channel the shard's power into a Varanticus. The Varanticus will become an embodiment of madness. Killing it will grant you mastery over that aspect of the dark power. What's the second method? There are shrines in the Nightmare Lands. Jedi in origin. There you could draw out and destroy the madness within the Shard. Not as elegant a solution, but it should work. So, will you slaughter beasts or seek the shrines? I can't wait to start killing. Very good. Yes, you will make an excellent specimen for my research. Return to me when you're finished. I will make sure the protective ritual is complete. I'm done. The Varanticus was no challenge. Who are you? What do you... Oh. Yes. I sent you to the Nightmare Lands. Back already? Very well. Let me see the shard now. Good. Good. Entirely purged. I will record this test as successful. Am I sufficiently protected against the insanity? You are as protected as I can make you. Whether that is sufficient remains to be seen. So, you will venture into the Dark Heart? Serevin sends you out there, does he? Yes, I'm sure he did. Very well. You are an unusual specimen. I don't know what will result from this. The deepest secrets of the Dark Heart lie through the Grim Warrens. Whatever you seek, it is likely there. You ordained him. You're the source of his visions. Bibien for Danike, Kersnadi, Namakampia, the Hormanan Margumak. Ika Togobarai, Kayes Nita, Mashi, the Tokalegal Wishi. Our cheers that my Tracia Kirkhe. I am in your debt. Selmakor still lives, but at last I am free of him. I have been a prisoner in the darkness so long. I must repay you for this. You have questions. My time grows short, but I will give you what answers I can. Who are you? Why should I listen to you? My name is Nemok Ta, and I once aided the Jedi in their war against the Sith. The creature you faced was an avatar of Selmakor. And I am one of those who brought his evil upon us all. Why don't you start from the beginning? Long ago, the Sith came to our world. To them, we were beasts, unworthy of notice. But then the Jedi arrived, pursuing them. To the Jedi, we were tools, weapons to turn against the Sith. 
The Jedi manipulated you into doing their dirty work. There was only one people here, until the Jedi came. We asked for power. They agreed if we would fight their enemies. We were greedy, insisted on learning all the secrets of the Force, heedless of the consequences. The Force rituals changed us. Those who studied with them became Voss. Those who did not became Gormak. All the conflict here has been the fault of Jedi interference. No, the fault is ours. We fought for the Jedi because we wanted power. Selma Kor was born from the sundering of my people. He is the darkness that devours this world. He feeds on strife. And so long as my people fight each other, the nightmare lands will grow. Please, outsider, return to Vos Ka and tell my people that they threaten Vos with their fighting. Selma Kor must be stopped. The Dark Power has a name, Sel Makor. I fought one of its servants, who claimed to have given Jokel his visions. This is something the Voss should hear. They've been pestering me endlessly since you left. My associate has returned at last, just as your mystic said. Deep inside the Dark Heart, he fought a servant of darkness which was the source of Jokul's visions. Thank you for defeating this creature, Outsider. We await the wisdom the mystic foretold. Your learning will shape Voss's future among the stars. I'm sure you've discovered something you can tell the three. Something relevant to the Empire's negotiations, perhaps? The ancient Jedi conducted experiments on Gormak, and their tampering unleashed the power in the Dark Heart. Such a crime is unthinkable. Why would the Jedi do us such harm? Is this how the Gormak learned to construct monstrosities? We do not know yet that this claim is true. Speak to your mystics. Ask them to confirm what my colleague has said. The Jedi have greatly wronged you. I'm just relaying information. We will ask the mystics to meditate upon this. We will halt all talks with the Republic until we know the truth. You have done all that was asked, Outsider. The vision is fulfilled. We will speak again, Ambassador Saravan. The mystics will consider what has been said here. Well done. Blaming the Jedi for the corruption at the Dark Heart was inspired. I didn't invent a word of it. The Jedi really are responsible for all the trouble here. All the better for us, then. They will cast the Republic off Voss and run to the Empire. I assure you I will make your role in this known to those who matter. You have been awarded a rare honor. Even I have not spoken directly to the three before. You have served the Empire well. When I secure Voss, I will do so in your name. The Emperor will be pleased. Your business is always welcome. <laughs>